everybody, welcome to another episode of Everything OneNote. I'm Andy Batiste, and today I've got a quick tip for you, and it's setting up sub pages in your OneNote. All right, guys, let's get started. But don't forget, if you like the content Nathan and I put out, don't forget to like and subscribe and hit that little bell button so you're going to get notified anytime we bring out new content. A simple tip that you might not have been aware of and it involves setting up all your pages over here in our left hand column. So obviously you have our sections on the left and then the next one to the right of that is our pages. So a little tip for a bit more organization is creating sub pages. So I often like to set up my pages where I have a content page where all the information goes and then I create separate worksheets related or specific to that information. And the way to keep that all nice and neat and together over there here on the left is setting up sub pages. So you can see it's already set up and I have a little collapsible option here. So all of those things can collapse under. And the simple way of doing that is going into that page, hitting right click and scroll down and finding the sub page option. Now I can make that a sub page again. You can make a sub page of a sub page. If I do that, you're gonna see it's just slightly more indented into that one. To promote that one. And then I'm going to make this one a sub page. So you can see it just sort of creates a slightly more indent into that image. So I'm gonna keep that, promote it. But if I decide I do it accidentally, or if I decide that I no longer want that to be a sub page, simply promote it. And you can see now that one defaults as the main page and the one below it turns into the sub page. So if I promote that one as well, they're all gonna become the same now. So they're not tied in. I lose the option of that collapsible window. When I distribute that out to the students, it's gonna follow that same structure. So the students will get the exactly same setup as you. So if you're not doing already anything that is a resource information relevant that you don't wanna have on the same page, you wanna create it as a separate page, definitely look at creating sub page. It's a really good tip for structure organization in your OneNotes.